Hello guys, I'm Sablast. Today I got myself some new strings. So, before I change my strings, I want to show you something. One weird string trick. If your string gets broken and if you are broke. <laughs> I learned this trick when I was a young guitar player on this guitar and I didn't have, have a lot of money for guitar, guitar strings so my string got broke you know uh, I was a bit you know, stupid I was an idiot and this was locked here you know basically it's because of this Edge 3 or Floyd Rose shit and this was locked and I was tuning the guitar and it broke here and I said, what the fuck, I just bought new strings, I have no money. So I had to learn a trick. So I took the string and I wanted to repair it. And I succeeded. So first I glued it right here with the glue. Bad idea. I was thinking and I was thinking and I was thinking and then I realized that I could create a small knot right here. So I tied the strings like, you know, this shit, like shoes. And it looked like shit. I thought it won't work. And I was desperate and I was tuning the guitar and as I tuned it, tuned it, the knob got better and better and it actually worked yeah I suck at playing but that was a cool trick now you can see that trick on my bass when people see it they say you're an idiot or they say you're a genius I don't know what what will you say but it helped me from getting new strings which are kind of expensive for me because I'm broke so as you can see right here this is tied in a knob uh, to be honest now I'm going to be honest how often you should change strings we'll talk about it later these bass strings are old for years after one year of playing it broke and I just tied it down and it holds for three years now and it would hold even longer but today I got some new strings uh, there's no there's no effect on the sound I, at least I think I could record with it I can do whatever it is. I don't care a lot about music quality but it holds pretty good like other things So, how this trick will work? It won't work if your string is broken right here. It will work if it's broken here, where you, of course, step, or right here. Uh, in my case, it breaks here or here in 90% of the time. If it breaks here, you can't fix it, obviously, because the knob will be right here. So, as you can see here, uh, I think this one was broken right here. So I tied it down. No, it was broken here. My bad, but sometimes it gets broke right here on my guitar, so I tied it down right here. And as you can see here, I didn't have the strings, uh, the string which was long enough, so I used another string, which is another trick. So now when I share the trick, I can change my strings. Let's talk about how often should you change strings. As you can see, I got some cheap bass strings. I bought this one because these ones because it has fire on it, and if it's if it has fire, I'm sure there are some better strings. You know, you just look at the fire. Who cares about the quality? And I got myself some guitar strings finally 
On my guitar, strings are old about two years. And some picks. Shit. I hoped they, they would put something in by mistake, but... So, I got strings for my bass, my guitar, and this bitch will have to wait, because I'm not Donald Trump. Ha! <laughs> Fuck you! So, how often should you change your strings? Well, some people say 6 months, some people say after 4 months, and some of the fuckers say after 1 month. Of course, why don't you change strings every play, you know, change strings, then play, they change it again, why not? <laughs> but, does it affect your sound and your guitar if you change them even less? Or, let's say, you have your strings for a few years. Okay, my guitar is not damaged, my sound, I don't give a fuck about the sound as long as it plays. Some people say it will damage your guitar, but use your logic. Your guitar can only be damaged from your skin, from the remaining of your skin on your strings. And that can damage the guitar, in my opinion. It only gets a bit on your fretboard, which you can clean. And I don't see why would you clean your guitar. It's fucking stupid to clean your guitar. You're not a female. <laughs> Uh, so, uh, don't be a pussy and play those strings as long as they hold. Because guitar company, I mean string companies will say, get into our company and change strings every month so we can get a lot of from you, you know? The thing is, I'm delivering proof that you don't have to change your strings that much. I mean, my bass is not damaged, my guitar is not damaged, my strings are old and I'll just replace them now clean my guitar a bit, or I'll call a female to clean it, and it will be as new. So, don't buy the shit, if you are recording, change the strings, if you're not recording, you're playing at home, you're fucking around, you don't have to change the strings, so, don't buy the shit, don't waste your money, okay, waste your money, but don't waste it that often, as guitar companies, string companies will say, that you should waste your money, or invest your money, so, I'll change the strings now and see you guys next time. Hey.